a project where I really wanted to embody my real self, which is one of the reasons why I even did um, I, my first single of the year officially was with Charlie Poppy. I had to start from the scratch, from home. That's the first time, you know, I'm actually having an African artist on my song from like my own end. And yeah, I wanted it to be raw, I wanted it to be local, I wanted it to be rich in locality and I have so much essence of what Afrobeat used to always be. Slowly, slowly, it's easier for people out here to actually create Afrobeats because we, the top dogs or the people who are pioneering Afrobeats, you know, over time because of the whole globalization, we're slowly watching it down. So this project is also a reset to like, yo, Afrobeats can be complex and we can all take it Africa to the world and yes i respect the fact that we're doing you know afrobeat to the world and everything and we are appealing to the people out here but i still feel like one more the home home gotta be vibrating because the first thing that made us go crazy globally was first of all the home has spotted us we built a huge fan base home and we respected them we loved them we we listened to them we wanted to know what they wanted to hear and i feel like that's what we should be focused on right now i'm very keen on just keeping our industry as strong as possible as long as possible because if you think about it over time from reggae to you know latino different genres had its like peak moment and i feel like afrobeat can last way 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 longer if we know what we are doing